Okay, we're going to go over what it takes to create a uh, blog in WordPress. Here you see we are in this menu on posts, all posts. You wanna click on add new post. Here you're gonna put your title. Now it's important that your title should be uh, including your keyword. Go into that in a minute when we get into the actual thing. So for this one, we're gonna call it, uh, I am, excuse my typing, I am a test. I'm only a test. Now, for this, we're gonna to wanna to edit with Elementor, which is the software we're using for all of the blogs. When we're here, once you get in here, you can start bringing elements in. So let's start with an image and you basically drag it and drop it. And then as you see, the titles already put itself in. Here's the first image to choose your image. You click here, which brings you to the image library. You can use any one of the images that are here in the library or upload a file. You click that, select your files, and it'll usually default to whatever your last open thing was. For me, that's gonna be my downloads. Uh, I'm not gonna go in there right now, but that's what it would be. Let's just say for the sake of everything, I'm gonna choose this image. Now, there should be, because when I entered this image initially, alt text already here, but we're gonna enter it in case there isn't any. So it's going to be cause marketing agency. Really helps if I can spell, doesn't it? Or type correctly. Marketing agency. And then we're gonna put the title here, which the keyword phrase is going to be only a test. We're then going to take this, put it in the description as well and select. Now we've got this part here. We click on this and then we bring in our heading, our first heading, put it here. And it's gonna be, what is it? I am a subheading and only a test. Now, for the sake of any blog you're doing, you want to have at least two or three of your subheadings should have your keyword phrase. That's gonna be how the SEO gets read, which you know. Uh, we're gonna add our text editor under this, and this is where we would enter the rest of our texts. So we have a lovely lorem ipsum. So when you click on this box, you bring up your options. To look at the SEO, we go here. Right now we have no keyword phrase, so we're going to add that. It's going to be only a test. So other things it's gonna look for, this will give you the things you want for your basic SEO. It'll tell you where you're missing information. Uh, one of the big issues right now is we have almost no data here, but the focus keywords in the subheading. But yeah, this will tell you all the bits that you need, all the bits that you have, all the bits that you're missing. The other thing you need is your meta description. You enter your snippet here under description. I am a meta description. This is only a test. Your keyword phrase needs to appear in your meta description. If it doesn't, it's going to not contribute. Now you notice this stupid little thing I've done has already scored at 65 out of 100. Uh, it's got almost no context to it. It needs at least 300 to 600 words to be considered acceptable. Usually you want to go a little longer these days, but there you are. So what you would do is save draft. You don't actually want to publish this thing yet, because if you hit publish, it will auto publish it. Then you want to hit the back button. That's kind of weird that shouldn't have done that. So we're going to go back to all posts. It'll show it. Yeah, here it is. I'm a test. I'm only a test. So we're going to click on this. Now to schedule, we're going to go here where it says publish immediately. We're going to edit and we get to choose when we're going to schedule it. In this case, we're going to pretend we're going to edit this on, we're going to do this on July 1, or June 1 at uh, 0754 AM. And by the way, the 07 puts it in the 24 hour clock and then click OK. If you click the schedule button, it will schedule this post. And that is how we upload and put a blog on the website. I am going to go back and erase this blog. But before I do that, we're going to go back to the all posts. We're going to look at one that's already here. This is the one that was just scheduled. 
Uh, and as you see, scheduled for, there's your date. Uh, the info is here. I don't know why it says the focus keyword doesn't appear at the beginning, because it really, really does. Uh, and then when you go over here to Elementor, you will see there's a blog. All right, so there we have it. You have the basics on how to set up a blog here in WordPress. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.